Now, one of the most popular style of filters, particularly for these all-in-one, off-the-shelf type aquariums, is the top filters. Now, the advantage of the top filters is they're super neat and super easy to clean. So, when they come, they come with either little carbon cartridges or little bags of carbon and usually filter material like noodles. And there are three types of filter materials. There are um, mechanical medias, which actually trap the garbage. Then there's biological media, which grows bacteria and breaks the waste from the fish down. And then there's um, chemical media, such as carbon, which sucks in toxins until it's full. So, the basic idea is the water just gets sucked up through the strainer, it goes into the pump, from the pump it gets shot up and gets shot through this top area here, and in this top area you'll have mechanical, chemical and biological filter media. Now these systems are very easily upgraded, and the way that you can upgrade the system is instead of using filter wool, you can use poly filter, and the poly filter will actually cling the particles instead of trap them, so therefore it won't bank up and potentially leak down the back of the aquarium if the water can't escape back down into the aquarium as it's supposed to. So the poly filter is really, really an insurance policy as far as the functionality of your aquarium is concerned. The other thing is the poly filter is going to, to remove all of your organic waste out of solution and it will not let it go like carbon. Carbon actually sucks in the waste until it's turgent, then it will actually start to release the waste back out again. Whereas the poly filter will change colour to tell you when it's full and it will um, not release the waste back into the water. And you can upgrade these little noodles by putting in a media such as Marine Pure which has potentially got 20 times the surface area of the noodles. So all in all, these filters are very handy, they're very easy to clean, they're very easy to set up, and they're very easy to modify. But as with all filters, they do work with nitrifying bacteria, so they do suck oxygen out of the water. So I'd still consider all filters to be for filtering, and I would rather add an air stone or an extra power head that's agitating the surface to make sure we've got more oxygen in the water from the fish.